Hey, I'm Jocelyn and this is my friend Sandra and today we are going to make for you a slow gin Ricky, not to be confused with a slow gin fizz. Um, I'm going to let you just go ahead and start making this drink because you know what, it's cocktail Friday. I need one. <laughs> Great, let's do it. Um, also not to be confused with a gin fizz. There are other gin fizzes yes. which use regular gin and not slow gin. Slow gin is a specific thing. Um, a it's very different. Yeah. Is a kind of fruit. Uh, and so this is, is made from slow fruits. Um, it's very, very British. So um, much more popular in the UK than in the than States. In the States. Um, it's kind of an old fashioned. Like, I always think of this like a little old, old fashioned. Old fashioned is it. Okay, so I was going to say that. And um, when I was bartending, I used to have this sweet little old lady who ordered slow gin fizzes. And I was like, wow, okay, we're finally gonna open that bottle of slow gin, <laughs> I remember. And she really liked mine, so she would come back all the time and get her slow gin first for me. So um, it took her years to get through that bottle of slow gin <laughs> behind the bar, but um, it was kind of cool somebody actually used it. So we just thought this would be a fun one to introduce you to because it's just not so common. It's yes. something different, and you know, if you're not, if you don't think you're gonna drink a whole lot of slow gin and whatever, um, we often will tell you go buy a couple airline bottles, and you'd be surprised at the checkout at your local liquor store how many funky different things are in airline bottles. So then you just get those little tiny, what are they, ounce and a quarter, ounce and a half. And it's a, it's a perfect way to try something new yes. without breaking the bank, decide whether you like it um, yeah. before you uh, invest in a large bottle or something. So Absolutely. Uh, you see, you saw me um, take a half a lot of lime and juice. So I have all of that juice here, fill my glass with ice, and I'm gonna take two ounces of slow gin. Does anyone else ever think slow ride? <laughs> I, I will say, now. I should not sing anywhere where other people can hear it. Um, but yeah, whenever I Isn't made things with slow color. gin, it is pretty. I've never had slow the fruit. I think next time I go to England, I'm gonna have to do that. I think you should. I think I will. So it's just three ingredients, yeah. and we're gonna top it with some club, club soda. soda. There, therein lies the name Fizz. Leave a little bit of space there at the top. Are you making a fizz yeah, or Ricky? Yeah. Is this a fizz or a Ricky? It is not a fizz, it's a Ricky. Yes, you do need some fizz. Okay. Sorry. So, yeah. Sometimes it's easier actually to push the ice down and, and then it pushes. It pops back up. Absolutely. So pretty. Take this wedge of lime and Squeeze that in too if you want. I don't think you need to really squeeze it since it's already got so much um, lime juice. But it's if that were regular gin, I'd be squeezing the heck out of that. But because it's slow gin, I don't have to squeeze the heck out of it. I actually really prefer slow gin to regular old gin. So, so sure. cheers. It's really good. It is like, um, I don't know how to describe the slow gin. It almost is, t it's, it's almost like something from my childhood that I don't know what. It's not like Kool-Aid or anything like that. It's not that sweet. It's like cranberry-esque, yes. but not quite. It almost leans toward a cherry limeade, but it's not as sweet and right. cherry as that. So, right. Um, it's a little more tart, like if you had a really tart one. But anyway, this is a fun drink. It's really tasty. Um, and it's so easy to make. You're just dumping a couple things in there. And if you want to juice limes like ahead of time and just pour... When you juice half and half a lime, it usually comes out to about half, maybe three quarters if you got a really juicy lime. So you can easily make a bunch of these. So if you just have lime juice sitting around, pop them open and um, treat your friends to something new and different. So, mm -hmm. cheers. We'll see you next Friday. Bye.